Hello everybody, my name is Yoshi, and welcome back to Until Dawn. This is now part 13 of the series. We're just getting back to the situation where they are pretty much all in the house now except for Josh. Because Josh is a jerk, and so now he's out in the barn tied to a post. Mike tied him there, and now they're all back in the house now, including Emily, who was just in the mines. And there was a knock at the door, and some dude came to the door, and he's talking about how this is not their land, and it's not his land. It's the Wendigo land. So he was in the middle of that conversation, and I had to end the series after part 12. So that's okay. So uh, welcome, everybody, to Until Dawn. So let's play it. Until Dawn. Let's go. Listen. To the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. <laughs> You're gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. Yeah, you can't let anybody dead. die, right? Then, I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. He going alone is suicide. Let him come with you. I, let him come Fine. with me. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Care. Be safe. Don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you Just understand? understand? Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. Shit. That means I'll probably have to do lots of triangles, circles, and squares action. This is the end. You point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? Trust me. I know. Hey. Come back safe. Oh, shit. Uh, we need to hurry, son. Got I, some uh, sugar. See you soon. <laughs> So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. What's uh, what, what's a guy got to know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. So, what's this butterfly? At? Okay, uh, okay. So, uh, stick together. I want to read this one. Chris didn't shoot Ashley. Ashley was concerned about Chris as he left. That's good to know. Let's stick together. Ashley followed Chris. Ashley failed to see who was in the workshop. See, I meant to look in there. I meant to. That's my fault. Emily was bitten. See, and then that's my fault. Actually, I'm a little bit glad she got bit. It'll add for some drama. How many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you be shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, it'll slow it down. Burn it. But how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it. And it can kill them if you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn okay. it off first. It's gross. Well, what, what are these uh. things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna well, do? Well, they adhere to some patterns. Like any animal. Or human. You mean, like how? They've got schedules? Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? 
I didn't ask. Is this blood? The uh, pro Wendigo tips. Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something. Oh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that. I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changes in the movement really? and field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. <laughs> That's not good. Damn it, what happened? What do you think happened? Oh, uh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He can still be out there. <laughs> First, the Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And then he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. So the launch then. Let's go now. It's crazy. You can see the fur on their jackets there. moving around, blowing around. That's cool. Am I coming? <laughs> I thought he was leaving me there for a second. Oh. Wait. Don't move. I didn't move. Run. Triangle. Go. Where? Now. Now. out there I'm I'm so sorry Ashley what about the old guy no sign of him Fuck. he's got to be dead too oh Christ all right these are all the doors yeah are you sure what are you looking for another way out Mike look, I really don't think that's a good idea we should stay put right here until dawn at least we're safe down here oh yeah all wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. 
I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then we're shit out of luck. You're SOL. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. M. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? It's, uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my. Wait, 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 what is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? You've been a cave in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Oh, my God. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody'd been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're going to get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Em? Em, what is... Huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my god, oh my god, it's, it's oh my nothing. god. It's nothing, it just, it, oh no, it, it no, bit no, me no. and... Bit you? What bit you? The, the Wendigo. The what? It's nothing, really, it's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really, it's, it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you... You could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You can't be down here with us. What? Mike. You got to go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Just like hell I am. Emily. You can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. What is this? Tire up. Guys, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh, no. You're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my God, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mike, calm down. You're... you're gonna shoot me? Mike, me? This is the safe room, M. <laughs> Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. <laughs> not for us. <laughs> don't, don't do this! I'm really sorry. I'm not gonna shoot her. I'm not gonna shoot her. Oh, I can't do this. Oh my god. This is the right thing. I hope you did. Maybe. For now. Shit. Fuck, fuck. Keep an eye on her. If you see anything weird, you guys know what to do. Yeah. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe so out there. Tie up Emily. I'll be back soon. Tie her up. You don't have to shoot her. You don't have to make her leave. You just have to tie her up. Make sure that she's not going to go crazy psycho on you. Because that's fucking what's going to happen. What is with you? Why do you look so weird? Why are you walking like that? Miss Creepy. I thought that, that he was going to help us. With a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. That's weird. No, guys, it just means we've got to be tough. We've got to do this on our own. Ashley, Old Hotel. I don't know if I can. AM. Who found journal cannibalism? Only a few have dared to hunt the Wendigo. I am the... 
This guy's a little OCD. Shining disaster, death toll rises. The stillness. There's combat. Oh, the Wendigo's eyes change. They become sharper and more. The Wendigo sees movement if it's... This says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. Crazy. There's the bite. Uh, hunger cravings. Uh, skull and ribcage found... Mm, relative relatives? Those are all the relatives? Jesus. What do we say? Uh, I have found native artifacts on the mountain and copied them. Totems, bunch of herbs and feathers. I've copied them. That doesn't really help me. Uh, Cree legends say that the Wendigo grows from the bite of another Wendigo. But the bite is harmless. I have been bitten, but I did not change. The only way is to eat the flesh of another. There is no other way. So she has to eat the flesh of another. Oh. Uh... Oh no, 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 what? no, no. What is it? What does good. it say? <sighs> Reassure? M, you'll be okay. Conceal? Just crazy stuff in here. Oh. Uh, just a lot of crazy stuff in here. It's kind of hard to believe, actually. It comes across as kind of a whack job. Uh, <laughs> she just took it from you. Shit. And I got the trophy. Shit. We've got to get to Mike. Like, now. Now they leave again. And they left the gun? Wow. Oh, Joshua. You it's should creepy. have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help her. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always okay. all about you. Oh, yeah. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become, huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? They hurt, and I didn't hurt anybody. Oh, but of course you did. They were your friends, you misled them, you lied to them, and you put them through a night of genuine horror. Is this a game? Is this Just a game? a game? But it was a game that has driven you to one of your own deepest fears, Joshua. You're now facing something worse than death itself. Absolutely crazy! And we are gonna end this episode here! And we'll pick it up into the next episode, and I believe that one was... was... What was that one? 10, 11, 12? Was that 12? I think that was 12. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. I need you guys to comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about this episode. And uh, let me know what you guys want to see. If you guys want to see... Uh, I, I want to play Doom. I think I'm going to get into that one. And I'm already doing uh, Watch Dogs 2. If you guys want to see more of that gameplay. I, I want to finish up Until Dawn first before I get into the next one. Uh, it's a little bit easier that way. Uh, kind of keeps the mood the same way too instead of bouncing around from game to game 
Uh, so thank you everybody for watching. My name is Yoshi. Don't forget that. Comment down below. Uh, all that stuff that I already said already. So, okay, you guys. You guys will see me soon. You guys will see me in the next episode. You guys, take care, all right? Please like, please subscribe. Peace. Love ya. And peace.